tell them about the hot sauces. All right. Hey everybody, this is Grouchy, bringing my buddy here, and he's going to be telling you about his sandwich shop and the most authentic gumbo I've ever tasted. As a matter of fact, my mouth is still burning, so go right ahead. How you doing? I'm Roger with the Big Kahuna Sandwich Shop. Um, let you know on Fridays and Saturdays we do a chicken and sausage and a shrimp and crab gumbo, real New Orleans gumbo. We also have our own line of hot sauces. We have the Jindo, which is a sweet curry hot sauce, our Zombie, which is the pepper style, and our Voodoo hot sauce, which is a habanero base. We have our own line of seasonings, as you can see right here. And look for it. Look for uh -oh. it soon on the internet. <laughs> Blue Gator is coming. And, and Blue, Blue Gator, Gator. Is, is it gonna, are, are you gonna have your hottest hot sauces in that lineup, or are you just gonna? Because I know there is a, a legendary one. Well, we, right now we have the three. Uh, I do have one that I'm going to be coming up with, and it is going to be hot. <laughs> the problem is it is, well, you can ask the young man here. He tasted it. <laughs> uh, how hot was that, Antoine? Uh, was, I'm still tingling. <laughs> and this is weeks ago, right? So, uh, But, you know, these hot sauces, man, the gumbo here is fantastic. And I've never found good gumbo in California. Gumbo, is, yeah. is there any place else in the world, uh, in California, I mean, that, that serves real Louisiana gumbo? That's the gumbo. That that's what the re real Cajun gumbo looks like. See? So this is the Big Kahuna Sandwich Shop. What's the address here, anyway? Seventeen Ten A Street. Seventeen Ten A Street in lovely downtown Antioch. And look at this. Oh. That is oh, a chicken and sausage oh. gumbo. And you made it kind of wussed out though for the Californians, right? It's not made as, well, you can make it as hot as you want it, but. I, I have down, I downgraded the, the heat level and the spice level because I'm Cajun, okay? And a lot of people here can't keep with the heat. So, however, <laughs> like I said, we do have our own line of seasonings. So we have full heat, quarter heat, half heat, and a no heat. So you can heat your gumbo to your, your own taste. Whoa. And like I said, with the hot sauces. Yeah, you can pour it in there. I just used one. Mine was voodoo. Yes, you have the voodoo on you. Whoop. That is the habanero base. Well, all I can say is all my sinuses are cleared up. Um, I was actually sweating, like underneath my eyes and the sides of my nose. Well, I had just stopped sweating because we were messing around with the hot sauces a minute ago. And the one I was telling you about is I have the powder for it right now, and I've been mixing. Oh my Lord. And yeah, my hand fingertips are still burning and my taste buds uh, are, are gone. <laughs> wow. So if you don't like it that hot, they'll make it any way you want to. But I want to tell you, they're the best dead gum sandwiches and best dead gum gumbo I've ever had. And that's how I've, I've even had Louisiana gumbo that wasn't as good as this. Well, so that is, that's real New Orleans gumbo so there. Come on by if you're ever in Antioch. I know that millions of people will see this, but anyway, 1710. here's 1710 A Street in lovely downtown Antioch. It's really close, Plaza. really close to um, Antioch High School. Yes, and I'm right across the street from Wells Fargo Bank. All right, that's right, because you'll probably need, you'll probably want to come back and buy a whole gallon of it. Do you, by the way, do you cater? Uh, actually, yeah, we just started catering sandwiches, and we're also looking at. We haven't started it yet, but we're looking at 